Hello. I'm going to sing an original song that I wrote uh, called Jesus You Are. Jesus, you are the light of all. Shine through this form into your kingdom. Jesus, you are the light of all. Shine through this form into your kingdom. Jesus, you are the light of all. Shine through this form into your kingdom. You came as a servant, ready and willing to die. You came as a savior to raise on high Jesus you are the love of God shine through this world bring us to heaven Jesus you are the love of God shine through this world bring us to heaven Jesus you are the love of God shine through this world bring us to heaven. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. Today I'm going to read a Bible verse and then I'm going to talk about the Bible verse. First, let's pray. Let's pray the Our Father together. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Let's see. Here's a, something Jesus was saying here in Luke 6, 20. He says, looking at his disciples, he said, Blessed are you who are poor, for yours is the kingdom of God. Blessed are you who hunger now, for you will be satisfied. Blessed are you who weep now, for you will laugh. So what is Jesus saying here? It's similar when he says in, uh, in the Bible, in the, in the Gospel, the first will be last and the last will be first. And he says often, those who suffer in this world will be exalted in the next world. That those who despise their life here on this planet, because this is Satan, Satan's realm essentially, the physical world, because we're apparently separate from God and we're apparently separate from each other. And love is that the absence of separation. And that's what God is. So when he says, blessed are you who are poor, you're poor only in this world. For yours is the kingdom of God. So you're going to have the kingdom of God. Blessed are you who hunger now, for you will be satisfied. So you hunger because you're poor. But the only thing that can really satisfy you is God. And you have that kingdom of God. Let go of this world and keep your sights on God. Keep your thoughts on God. Keep your heart set on God. Keep your body and your mind and your soul and your heart on God all the time. Blessed are you who weep now, for you will laugh. So those who are weeping because of this world, soon you will laugh. So, thank you. I just wanted to share that with you today. Have a good day.